this is just a short video on how to add a booking if it is your first party or first booking. Um, so your launch party or any open parties will appear in the open parties column. And then from there, you want to click on the party and you will get a menu or dashboard across the top. Sometimes it will make you confirm shipping and it should be grayed out direct ship to all guests. That's what you want it to default to. Um, it may allow you to bypass that, but sometimes it does not. You're going to click on review bookings and then when you add a new booking, if someone in that party has already ordered, their information will show up. If they have not, then you will do add new booking without previous guest and you will enter their information that way. Um, so in that case, you will need their name, email, phone number, and mailing address if they are a new customer to you, um, someone who hasn't ordered. If they've ordered before, but just not on the party that they're booking off of, it should auto fill that information anyways. So unless they're totally new, um, and again, if they've already ordered in the party, it will auto fill for you there. Um, so for the party name, you typically want to use their name because that's how it'll appear, appear on your dashboard. And then you can either put the month that they're booking in or if you have a theme, right? So cleaning with water, um, or the month or a specific date. This is also what shows up when their party goers click on their party link. That's the little banner on the website. So right now I am doing um, Winter Buying Club and I'm just booking the next month. My final month of that. Okay. And for the date, it really doesn't matter, um, but you do want to ballpark it because they're listed in date order on your homepage. So for my month long ones, I usually just pick the middle of the month and I always just pick 8 p.m. because that's when I usually do my demos. But again, the date doesn't really matter. It's more that that's going to order it for you on the homepage. Then you'll click save. And it will list um, any bookings that you have, whether someone has booked by clicking on it on their own or you've added them. And then also when you go to the host order, whether you're ready to do it now or later, you should see that it will show how many bookings you have. So always double check that before you go to close somebody out um, that you have entered the bookings that you need for that party, okay? When I go back to my dashboard, um, and again, by date, that is for March, so it's not showing up yet. If I click on view all, it is in my list of upcoming parties. 